And Axel brings these TVs that are no longer good because they broke for one way, one reason or another. Who knows why they broke, but they broke. And, uh, you know, you always want to shoot a TV and see what happens. But anyway, so we're getting to the story now. We get out there. We have our fun. We shoot. Now we want to go home, right? We just, we're done. We want to go home. Guess what? Axel lost his keys to the car, to the truck. So now, and we don't have cell phones. We don't have beepers. We don't have anything, right? So or we might have a beeper. That's useless because you can't call anyone. But <clears throat> any, uh, we're screwed. The sun's going down. It's getting dark. And he doesn't, his keys are not in the car and they're not in his pocket. So now we have to double back everywhere we were walking. And it's kind of like sand and, you know, dirt and the mountains. And, you know, you're, we're backtracking a lot of, a lot of, and we're walking here, we're walking there. It's getting dark. And my wife's great. They shot each other. They're dead or they got, you know, or they got in a shootout with somebody, you know, what's going on. You're going to be home before sundown because it gets dark. And, it's like, you know, eight o'clock at night. What's going on? You know, she's thinking, what the hell's going on? So, oh, yeah. the story. So I see Axel's walking on this ridge, like a mountain ridge. And, and he's got these boots on. He's, you know, uh, cowboy boots or whatever. And I guess his, the pants, his pants were in the boots, not out of the boots, but in the boots maybe. Or, or maybe he was wearing, but for whatever reason, the keys fell out of his pocket and had fallen in the boot. And he is just realizing that there's like a rock in his boot and it's bothering him. So he's reaching in his boot to like pull out this rock that's bothering him. And he comes up with the keys. <laughs> so <laughs> it's not necessarily a Guns N' Roses story, but if you tie in my wife's worrying about us and, and it's dark, it's way dark, nine o'clock at night now. And, you know, if <laughs> you tie that all in, a, and, we, and if he didn't find those keys, we would have been there just stuck. I mean, We'd have to like start walking, you know, like five or 10 miles to get out of there to find like somebody to help us or, you know, <laughs> so that's just like, I've never I, told the story, but it just jumped in my head because my wife tells it all the time. It's making fun of us, but 